Welcome to This Is The Day with Bo and Ariana. And that kid. Uh, wow. Drew Chris. Wait, can we just, one, just do one thing? One, two, three. Hosts. 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 This is the day brought to you by the number three. <laughs> 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 I don't know what just happened. <laughs> so, mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Okay. Happy Friday. It's like we're going, uh, 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 there's, uh, things are not the same. Mm, not Guys, the same. I'm just here. I just want to enjoy it, all right? So just you do you, and I'm here. Okay. Okay. You got the best seat in the house. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah, the back of our heads. <laughs> well, you know what? We're throwing throwing the peeps a curveball. Yeah, yeah, I gotta, gotta keep them on their toes. I like it. Keep I like it. I like toes. it. I like it. All right, welcome to this is the day Friday edition. Friday edition. Shenanigans on and Tom Foolery sure to follow. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, I would only planned on shenanigans and then Tom Foolery showed up. Over Had there. to. Yeah, yeah. Howdy neighbor. Hey, howdy neighbor. So yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> We're gonna get down on that. Uh, you know, really, the three of us do want to celebrate uh, the, the good news. The good news. We, we've, we've shared it the last couple of days, yes, but uh, this is the day was picked up for season two. Fantastic. Let's go. Yes. 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 That's right. I mean, Drew. Yeah. We. We can't believe it. You've been canceled from everything you've ever done. <laughs> <laughs> and we did think you were going to take that and bring it to this thing. Yeah, for sure. For I mean, sure, uh, yeah, we did. yeah. Uh, but uh, no. <laughs> I've even had the canceling where it's not a cancel. It's just you move down the line a little bit. Yeah. You know, you'll play left field. You know. Yeah. That's basically. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna need you on the other side of the fence, there, Buckaroo. The <laughs> but no, uh, you'll cheer for us. But we gotta. We've got a second season coming. Second season two season. coming uh, mid-September. Uh, so a little, little hiatus yep. for this is the day for the month of August and the first two weeks in September, six weeks hiatus for us to uh, prepare and get ready for season two of this yeah, is yeah. the day. Let's go. Boop, 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 yeah, boop, boop. we're pumped and excited uh, for the this is the day fam. Um, plenty of plenty of this is the day to re-enjoy. Mm -hmm. So much of it. Or discover even for the mm -hmm. first time mm -hmm. out there uh, on uh, YouTube. There if you actually type in this is the day battleship, mm. you will get arguably the best episode yeah. of this is the day. I would argue it wasn't the best episode. Not <laughs> proud okay. of it. Uh, oh, that's fine. But there was there was an episode <laughs> where uh, one Drew Chris and myself played an entire game of Battleship throughout the whole episode. For an hour. Yeah. It was an hour. Yeah. It was an hour long. Yeah, hour long. And it is, it is. I think one of, I'll, I'll say hours, so I can include myself in yeah. it, even though I was not involved in it. Um, best moments. Yeah. yeah so, so maybe uh, maybe you guys have a favorite moment mm -hmm. um, from this today. Love to see that in the chat. Yeah, please share and, that. And uh, help us uh, yeah. remember some of those and. That's Maybe so we'll fun. Uh, put them on the highlight reel. <gasps> highlight reel. Highlight reel. Ooh. Ooh. A highlight reel. <laughs> mm -hmm. that'd, be, that'd be a lot of fun. So anyway, we're, we're excited about that. Thrilled uh, to be coming back in uh, mid-September. So we'll yeah. have another week of episodes next week. And But this is Friday. So sure we're going to have a great day. You guys ready for a proverb of the day? It's a proverb of the day. It's a proverb of the day. Wow, you almost drowned her out, dude. Like that was so good. Is that good? That did sound like a good thing. <laughs> but you didn't. I, but, I, but I had I, <laughs> I had you in my ear. <laughs> so much easier to sing that way. All right. I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> it's a proverb of the day. Proverbs 23:22 says, "Listen to your father who gave you life, and do not despise your mother when she is old." Listen to your father who gave you life, and do not despise your mother when she is old. All right. Fam, what jumps out at you? You laughing. 
Okay. <laughs> Why'd you laugh? <laughs> I'm not even lying. Like, that's what stood out to me. You uh, said, when she's old, and then you went. <laughs> it's made me giggle. I believe it, because it's, like, it's almost like uh, you're going to despise your mom when she's old, <laughs> all right? So you don't want to do that. It's like giving you, like, a heads up. <laughs> yeah, respect, be old. respect your mom when she's old. <laughs> <laughs> Mom, you've told me this story 18 times in the last hour, but I, I am going to listen to it again just in case the ending changes. I will not despise. But I would like for you to know, in case you were unaware. <laughs> so that's why you laughed? Uh, yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, just. Okay, I was just wondering. I mean, I don't want to despise my. You know, don't despise your mom at any age, right. but. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Well, I don't know, like. Yeah, go ahead. Just like children come into the world so helpless. And parents are given this great, I mean great in a lot of ways, like that it's heavy, but also that it's literally great, responsibility um, to raise these children in the, wor in the word and, and in, a, in a godly way. And, and that's a huge responsibility. So to then grow up, and be like, <laughs> and to begin to, to either disrespect or despise, um, it just feels a little bit kind of yuck to me. Because yeah. um, no matter, like there's never gonna be any perfect parenting or, or being a kid, you know, you're never gonna have one that's perfect, but, um, but that God, God knows, God gave you your specific parents. Yeah. Like your family is mm -hmm. your family, and he and he knew that it wasn't like, oh yeah, you can go over there and you can go over there. Like, that's that's an on purpose, and so um, to to really respect that. Mm. Well, I think to recognize uh, it, it is difficult. Yeah. So the the parent child dynamic is is a difficult one, um, where a child is totally dependent, but then you're also raising a child to become independent. Yeah. Um, and then they become independent and now they're, they're breaking away, but then in the aging process, the parents historically have become dependent upon their, right. their children mm -hmm. and the way that you know, the aging process works and the family dynamic works, it kind of comes full circle. Yeah. And so you have a, a constant redefining of this relationship, which is a really a beautiful picture of all relationships. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, but the first human relationship you, you have is with your parents, um, you know, with, with your mother and your father, but then this, relationship is going to change so much over time and it can be it can be tough <laughs> and I mean like you know I, I'm at a stage you know where I, I have a, a 20 year old a 16 year old and a 14 year old and you know sometimes the boy will be showing me what to do you know how to how to do something on my phone or on the, the computer and he'll scoff at me you know mm. and I'll go boy I taught you how to use the toilet <laughs> okay mm -hmm. you know you, you can teach me how to, this app works yeah mm -hmm. and not do it with an attitude you know that, that'd be appreciated um, but th that's okay. I mean, that, yeah. that, that's part of that dynamic and the, the changing nature of relationships. So I love that we get some great wisdom from God in that. I mean, even, you know, like one of the Ten Commandments, honor your mother and father. And then we're told that this is the, uh, that it may go well with you and you may enjoy a, a long life. It's like the first commandment with a promise. Mm -hmm. And it makes sense. I mean, if your parents' job is to keep you alive, then do what they tell you, yeah. <laughs> you know, um, because because that's, that's their job and what they're trying to do. Um, but then take what they've given to you and then um, share that back with them as they um, are aging. Yeah. yeah. Pretty cool. Yeah. I've been wearing a lot of uh, adult diapers. Um, I don't really need them, but I just want to train my sons that you will eventually <laughs> need to be taken care of me. So listen when daddy needs a change. Yeah. There, there might be easier ways Okay. To, to get that principle. Across. Yeah, to do that. Mm -hmm. But okay. yeah, no. If you want to use adult yeah. diapers, <laughs> it just depends on you. Depends on you. <laughs> <laughs> what you said too about like you following, listening to your parents. Like back in the day, it was like, don't eat that berry, eat that berry. Like it was like actual like. Yeah, you you would die. die. Like, yeah. Actually, it yeah. still is though. Yeah, it really yeah. is. It still yeah, is. look both ways before you cross the street. Right. You know, be right. home at this time. Yeah. Don't. Take candy from strangers. I mean, how, you know, yeah. mm -hmm. um, you know, don't use that app or, you know, this, right. here's what this looks, I, I mean, all these things are, uh, uh, parents are, are trying to protect their children, mm -hmm. but also raise them and teach them. Yep. So listen to your father who gave you life and do not despise your mother when she is old. Yeah. That's a good problem. It's fantastic. So helpful. So good. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, less helpful, less good our calendar page. Okay. I have faith. Oh, we had talked about Miss 
misplace uh, faith. You know, if you misplace your hope, you know, let's not put our, our faith in. Listen, I don't think it's misplaced because yesterday was a great fun fact. Mm. I'm, yep. writing, I'm writing the great fun fact into okay. today. We can I? celebrate yesterday, but today's the day. Okay. okay. Today's a word of the day. Word of the day. Did I do it right? <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> word. Word of the day. Tell me like you were it? falling. I was. Yeah. Is satiate. Satiate. It's pronounced say, she ate. Say, she ate. Say. <laughs> say, <laughs> she ate. She ate. Satiate. Good for her. It's, uh, it's fun to say it with a whistle. Okay. Satiate. I wish you wouldn't. Sis. I wish you It'd wouldn't. It'd be tough to say if you had a slur. Satiate. Still wishing it's, you uh, wouldn't. It's satiate. What's it mean? Satiate. What does it mean? Say she ate the berry her mother told her not to. She gone. She, she gone. <laughs> she gone. She gone. She out of here. The word satiate uh, okay. means to satisfy. Mm. Okay. A need, a desire, etc. Fully or to excess satiate to satisfy fully hmm. or to excess hmm. satiate okay all right uh drew would you like to use the word satiate in a sentence absolutely okay um hey did uh did evelyn eat already <laughs> yeah she said yeah I'll, i could say she ate. <laughs> Completely 100% correct uh, in Oklahoma. Sorry. 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 I can't even recover from that. No. Okay. Okay. Um, why did you use the name Evelyn? Like, did that just come up? Like, you just. Evelyn? No, I, Evelyn. Oh, um, um, oh, I was talking to him last night, and he did say she ate. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. I don't know, did he? <laughs> he did. Okay. He did say she ate. Mm -hmm. Okay. He did. Good. Good for him. She ate a lot. Yeah. Yep. He, he was explaining yeah. Yeah, it was, all of the things that she ate. It was a buffet. Yeah, it was, <laughs> they were at, a, uh, what is it, Golden Corral. They golden were at a Golden Corral. corral. Mm -hmm. And yeah, so she was full. Yeah, she was full. I was just wondering, so I asked him. She was satiated. Yeah. Sure, with food, yeah. Yeah, with food. Yeah. Ace was crying the other day. Uh oh. I was like, boy, what, what is going on? He just, he wouldn't talk. He just he kept crying. And I'm like, boy, speak up. I don't know what's wrong. And uh, he uh, all of a sudden just said, say she ate my chicken nuggets. <laughs> and Longfellow had stolen all his chicken nuggets. Mm. She was satiated. She was satiated. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he had the 20-piece, yeah. Mm. 20 piece. Mm. It's a lot of nuggets for a little while. She's not yes. that big. It's yeah. too many nuggets. That's too a lot many of nuggets. nuggets. Yeah. She overnugged. She overnugged. <laughs> <laughs> that she did. Is she okay now? No, she's in rehab. Uh -huh. <laughs> On the road to recovery though. Mm -hmm. For overnugging. Overnugging. Yeah. Overnugging. <laughs> mm. Can't, can't it's hard go to there. know with the caloric intake of each individual what will actually get them to satiation. <laughs> it's hard to know. The caloric intake. <laughs> All right. Thoroughly satiated. I feel like uh, we have satiated this this this, this segment. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. yeah. Sure. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Word of the day. We have another uh, calendar page that gives us a day to celebrate, and this is actually. Uh, when I laughed earlier, mm -hmm. this is why I laugh uh, in the proverb of the day. Because okay. <laughs> today is gorgeous grandma's day. Mm -hmm. And when I read about, you know, your mother when she is old, I, it, yeah. it made me chuckle because today is gorgeous grandmother's day. Mm -hmm. Gorgeous grandma's mm -hmm. day. Grandma. Mm -hmm. Gma. Gma. What, what do you call your grandmother? Virginia. <laughs> 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 no, just grandma. <laughs> grandma, you got uh, granny names there over there? You? Me? Do yeah. I have any names? For your grandma. Grandma. And, okay, mm. Situ. 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 Oh, yeah. I've heard okay. That. I had, uh, mine were um, Grammar. Grammar. And Grandma Cha were, were my two. Okay. Grammar and Grandma Cha. Okay. Yeah. Well, um, we... I asked uh, Inslee again the other day. Mm -hmm. I said, uh, now what are your children going to call me? 
because I picked up my name. It's Mac Daddy, by the way. That's that's what the grandkids will call me is Mac Daddy. And I go, so it, and I just want to make sure the kids remember. So um, I said, Inslee, do you remember? She goes, yeah, what is it, G-Money? I'm like, well, that'll work. Huh. You're like, I took <laughs> that's what you can call your mom. Right. Yeah, she G-Money and I'm Mac Daddy. Because G-Money's going to buy you things. That's right. The one click. Yeah. yeah. Um, Hello! Uh-oh. What do we have? Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Who is Hello? this person? Whoa. Whoa. You're going to have to speak up. Who, who are you? Marjorie. Mar Who are you? Uh, my name is Bo. Oh. Oh. Okay. This is my this is my Have friend we Drew. Met before. Uh, actually, Marjorie, we did. Uh, I'm having trouble seeing and hearing. Let me put on my 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 seeing lenses. Oh, Bo. <laughs> yeah. We have met before. Why yeah. didn't you tell me? Well, you were here last year for gorgeous Grandma's Day. For what? Gorgeous Grandma's Day. Can you hold this? Yeah, absolutely. For what? Gorgeous Grandma's Day. I am. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Did you notice my hair? Did you get a permanent? I got it done. Did you go to the beauty parlor? <laughs> I did. I did. I had a wonderful time. It's it's new. Can you tell it's different? Yes, yeah. it's brighter now. That's fantastic. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. So we're celebrating me? Yes, absolutely. Do you have any questions? I do. Oh, I do okay. have so many questions. What okay. are they? What are your hobbies? Hobbies? I like to drive really slow. I like <laughs> to get my hair done. And that is all I do. <laughs> and I don't know how I got here. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how I'm going to get out of here. But it's OK. You two are very kind. <laughs> Thank yes. you for the questions. Yes. And Absolutely. for calling me gorgeous. Yes. Sure. Thank you. Thank okay. you. Marjorie, mm -hmm. have you ever been to a bingo? A bingo? A bingo? No. Oh, What's that? You got to get to a bingo. I should get, is it a? It's a game. It's a game. Yes. You've been to a bingo, Bo? B-I-N-G-O, 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 and bingo was his name, oh. Yeah. Who is he? He he is Bingo. Bingo. Yeah. The, the per, he. It's his game. It's There's his a game. farmer. The farmer. And his name was Bingo. No, he had a dog. Okay. And the farmer's dog's name was, was Bingo. 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 He named the game the game oh. after the dog. Yeah. So how do you play this game? It's a card, spelled out Bingo, um, and you if you get a certain letter and corresponding number to that letter, you get the dauber. It's like a little marker. You try to get it. Oh, in a it's row. a chicken. Uh, yes. It's a chicken. chicken. Yep. Oh, fun. That's a bit. so it's a farming game. Farming game. Ah, farming game. Yep. Thank you for thank you. I I I could farm. <laughs> I I like I like the outside. It gets right. a little hot though. It does. Yeah. It, does. it does. Yeah. It does. All right. Okay. Okay. Well, thanks for having me. Yeah. See, the elderly do have a purpose. Where Where do I go now? Oh, you'll just go out there. Just go out. Just go. Just I'll just go. Yeah, you can. Okay. Well, All thank right. you very much. Bye, I'm gonna Marjorie. Go. Okay. Bye. Thanks, okay, Marjorie. Okay. See you never. Okay. Gorgeous. gorgeous. Thanks. Thanks for celebrating gorgeous me. Grandma okay. Today. I gotta go. I gotta go. You sure you don't want me to say? Yeah, you can. Sure you don't want me to say? Okay. Bye, everybody. Okay. Bye. <laughs> bye. Bye, Marjorie. She was lovely. I know. I hate that Ariana missed the whole thing. She's Guys, I'm off. sorry. I'm whoa, sorry. Whoa, 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 I'm sorry. Okay. Guys, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. I had to go. I understand it. I had to go. She's but busy. now I'm back. She's very busy. I, have, you, have you ever met Marjorie? Who? Marjorie. No. Who's that? She's. Do we have a publicist? No, I, maybe she. That would be good. That'd be good. Yeah. So, good. No, I've never. Sorry. Okay. Did she? Was she just here? Yeah, you missed out. Oh. Yeah. She's quick. That one. Yeah. yeah. Mm, okay. Well, maybe next time. Maybe next time she's here, I can. Can you guys make sure that I'm here when she's here next time, so well, I can meet her? Well, she just shows up sometimes. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. So we'll, we'll do our best. Oh, okay. Sweet. Thanks, guys. Okay. Great. So uh, you want to do a little trivial pursuit? Sure. All right. Uh, here's. I have options. Okay. <laughs> Either we can do an old card and a new card. Okay. And you, we'll we'll switch off who's reading what questions. Okay. Or we can just do one card. And Drew, you can give an answer, and then I'll give the answer. Absolutely. Which one would you rather do? Option two. Okay. So Love it. we're going to play Trivial Pursuit. 
And uh, the way this works is there's six questions on a Trivial Pursuit card. Changing up just a little bit today. Drew and I, we're going to do a little team effort. Little team. Going after those pop, 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 pop rocks from the Fun Dip box. Yeah. Uh, they're the congratulatory variety. And um, they're right there, ready to go. So if you get all six questions right, we will send them to you. And maybe a nasty note. Mm. Yeah. Um, so we gotta you gotta guess in order to, to win. So I'm gonna guess that all six. Drew's gonna help and guess that all six. I'll, I'll let you give your answer first, and then I'll I'll either agree <laughs> or provide an, a correct, uh, answer. correct. A, a different answer. I don't know that it'll be correct. <laughs> we have the original 1981 edition of the classic board game Trivial Pursuit and the 40th anniversary edition, the oldest cards, newest cards, dealer's choice, going older new. I'm going new. New. All right, here we go. Drew loves the new card. I love the new, the new. Right. new card. Hot off the presses. Okay, blue. Blue. Geography. Geography. Which country has the longest coastline? Mm. Which country has the longest coastline? So this mm -hmm. is a country. Has the longest What's coastline. <clears throat> is it is it Chile in Central America? That's basically like all coast. Is, am I right with that? Uh, I, uh, it's it's your call. What's your answer? Wait, wait, wait. Is Australia? Australia is a country. It's a country. And a continent. And a continent. That is true. I'm gonna say Australia. Okay, your answer? Drew's saying Australia. Okay. Okay, which I like. Okay. That's definitely the direction I was going. Um, the only other thing I could think to say would be Antarctica. Right. You seen how big Africa is, though? That's a, That's I know, a continent. I understand, but I'm wondering if there's a country be a lot of coastline. that commandeers some of that coastline. All right. So between the two of us, those are our two guests. Okay. Guesses. <laughs> Neither of those are right. Okay, well, we're going to guess for real. Russia. Yeah, totally. No. Final answer? No, yes. No, 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 no. It shouldn't be. What's your final answer? It shouldn't? It should not be Russia. What's it your actual not. final Canada. answer? The Philippines is also not a country, <laughs> correct? <laughs> what, what, what did you just say? What did you just say, Bob? Uh, Canada. Is that your final answer? Canada is my final answer. Yeah, Canada is correct. What? A lot of coastline. A lot of coastline really? there. Really? The yeah. Yeah, it's big. All right, pink. Pink, uh, entertainment. What fiery female comedy legend? Whoa. Wow. Was responsible for saving Star Trek? Fiery female comedy legend. Legend. Was responsible for saving, saving Star, Star Trek. Trek? Yep. Wow. What? You got a guess there? Oh, man. Kathy Griffin? <laughs> uh, is not my answer. That is uh, it, yeah, no. Saving Star Trek would have been in the 70s, maybe? Lily Tomlin? No. I don't know. Fiery. Fiery, though. Who's fiery? Well, we got, like, Lucille Ball. Yep. Roseanne. Carol Burnett. Carol Burnett. Carol Burnett. Is that your answer? That's my answer. Drew says Carol Burnett, so I will say Lucille Ball. Lucille Ball is correct. Let's go. Oh, look at that. Um, yellow. Yellow history. Which fashion designer made Michelle Obama's gowns for the inauguration balls of 2009 and 2013? Vera Wang is my... Vera, Vera Wang? Vera Wang. Or who's... No, 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 no. Yes, Vera Wang. That's your answer? Because that's where I was going to go. Is that where you're going to yeah, go? Yeah, I was, so I'll come up with somebody else. Yeah. Starts with a G. It's a male. What's his name? Georgie Armani? Yeah. Sure. Neither are correct? Nope. Okay. Gucci. <laughs> uh, Mr. Gucci. Mr. Gucci. <laughs> <laughs> um, Jason Wu. Jason nope. Wu. I've never, I've never heard of this designer. Me yeah, I couldn't have nope. gotten that right. Uh, I know his brother, John Wu. I know his films. He's made some good. Yeah. Films. Made a lot of money. Purple. Purple uh, art and literature. Which... Um, am I reading the same? No, sorry. Which American designer donated $10 million to the Smithsonian to help repair the flag that inspired the Star Spangled Banner? Uh, Ralph Lauren. Yeah, so since he said Ralph Lauren, I'll say Tommy Hilfiger. Ralph Lauren is correct. Yeah. I was yeah. with you. Okay. 100% in agreement. Green. Green, science and nature. Which company used the tagline, imported from Detroit? Which company? Yep. Imported from Detroit. Okay. <clears throat> Ford Motors. That's a good, that's, that's definitely where I was too. Okay. That's the biggest company there. Yeah. Um, Procter & Gamble. 
Chrysler. Chrysler. Ooh. Yeah. Okay. Should have gone with another car company. That's orange. my bad. Yeah. Okay. Orange. Orange uh, sports and leisure. The home team is responsible for doing what to a hockey puck? Mm. Uh, like taking a bite out of it. Like they check it with their teeth to make sure it's not like a hostess <laughs> cupcake. Yeah. yeah, no, that's the only way to check that. You gotta that. be careful. Uh, I, I don't know. Yeah, uh, greasing did. it? Greasing the puck? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know much about hockey. Freezing the puck. Freezing. That's correct. Freezing. <laughs> <laughs> greasing it? I don't know. Deflating it? We got it. I think we got it. I think we got it. Inflating it? We definitely, yeah, we got a few of those, right? Deflating it. <laughs> we did not get them all right, though, but if you did, let us know, because this card. be happy to send you a uh, congratulatory would you be happy to? Rocks. Because you send a lot of Fun. nasty notes Box. all the time. What if the note I like writing nasty notes. I write a lot of nice yeah. notes. Right. So the occasional nasty note is a nice break in the action. Fair. What if we could make the nasty part of it be like the stench of the note? Like maybe the note nope. smells better. Next. <laughs> I don't think that's What's a good the idea next thing we should do? <laughs> I've received a not malodorous that. note. <laughs> not that. For sure not that. Ooh. Mm -hmm. This is a vomit note from Bo. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> Just include like one of those <laughs> gross jelly beans. Ew. All right, you want to do a little everyday with Jesus? Sure. Yes. All right, our daily devotion in 140 characters or less. Our thought for the day says, God is doing a new thing with you. The old is gone, the new has come. God has done away with the past, and he is ushering in a new reality. And then our verse is Isaiah 43, 19. See, I am doing a new thing. Now it springs up, do you not uh, perceive it? I am making a way in the desert and streams in the wasteland. Mm. That's good news. It sure good news. is. Now the old is gone, the new is here. God's doing a new thing with you. Well, that's like what we were talking about yesterday too with forgiveness. Like that is part of the new thing that is coming. Like you are forgiven, you are made new. Like this is like part of that process as well, like forgiving yourself because God has forgiven you. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah. Just thinking about it. Yeah, he's doing a, he's doing a new thing with you. So uh, that's exciting too, because that, again, that whatever we were is, is a part of, of who we are right. and mm -hmm. how we uh, see the world. Um, but this beautiful word repent is to, to no longer conform to the pattern of this world, but be transformed by the renewing of our minds that then now we have the opportunity to look through the world at the world through a different lens. And so while our experiences are, are a part of that, that's not what defines us anymore. We have this new reality um, where we believe and that God is redefining us and reshaping us and remaking us in his image. Mm. And that's a, that's a beautiful thing. And we, that's why I, even, I like that, uh, that scripture in Isaiah, do you not perceive it? God, God's, and that's the thing. Sometimes we don't perceive it. Mm -hmm. You know, we, we find ourselves in the wasteland or the wilderness, and we we've lost touch with the way. And Jesus is the way um, that He's making uh, a way for us uh, in you, wherever you are, and whatever you're going through. Do you not perceive it? You know, look to Him and pray and call out to Him and and listen to His voice and obey. Yeah, you know He's doing it. God is doing a new thing. You know he's doing it. Who's doing it? God is doing a new thing. <laughs> I knew That's that it? Was, that's it. I, I knew that was going to DC talk he from he's doing it. back in the, in the day. Yeah. Back in the day. Back in the day. But it's true. Absolutely true. Yeah. All right. Well, uh, Friday edition, thanks for joining us. Thanks for having me. Drewski. Great job. <laughs> <laughs> Personality high fives right there. There it is. Yeah. There, it just happened. Don't despise your mom when she's old. No, absolutely not. <laughs> Remember that. I'm going to call my mom. Okay. Yeah. What are you going to call it? <laughs> Gorgeous grandma. Oh. Yeah. There you go. Nice. Didn't see that coming, did you? Mm -mm. Okay. No, Drew's, Drew's a little thrown off. Oh, he doesn't no. really know where to go with Throw that, back. actually. He's like, mm -hmm. <laughs> All righty. Well, this is the day. Hope you have a day, and we'll catch you Monday.